Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another episode of the Venom Vlog. And today I actually have some random news for you. Just a lot of carnage and Venom related stuff. And I figure we're getting so close to the movie coming out, I would just throw this quick little video together to talk about some recent things that have popped up. For example, like Venom and Carnage showing back up in Fortnite. Obviously we have the Carnage uh, skin that's going to be out there. And then we also got some information in a vi in actual visual now of Eddie Brock here in Movie Venom, which is really cool. So that's going to be available in Fortnite, uh, either right now or coming up very soon. And then speaking of like games and stuff that you can play, there's also like the mobile game that we played. Well, it's kind of a website game for, uh, for Venom Let There Be Carnage, but we played it recently with my dog Echo. Um, so that's still available. I'll put a link to that website down below if you want to check that out. But then there's also this mobile game called Free Fire, which I have never played or actually heard of until now. But apparently it seems like it's like a PUBG style game or something like a Fortnite where they just drop you in and you all, you know, pick up weapons to fight each other. But they've been releasing little teases all week, and it turns out those teases were actually, you know, confirming that they were doing a crossover with Venom Let There Be Carnage. And to what level yet, I don't really know, at least as of recording this video, but just be on the lookout. If you want to check out Free Fire, you know, go check out that app, download it, and play the game. I don't know if I'll have time to get into it, but I'll keep an eye on it and see if I can't, uh, you know, if I can play it, I will, and show some footage here. But uh, I don't know if I'll have time with everything going on right now with my health and stuff and work, and there's just a lot going on. And so I, that's why I'm kind of consolidating all of this into just one video real quick. Um, but yeah, so you saw the teasers there, and they kind of led up to the, you know, the announcement that they're doing a crossover with Venom Let There Be Carnage. But then there's also a fan screening, another screening uh, for this movie which will be happening on Monday, uh, September 27th, uh, which is just tomorrow, actually, as of this, when this video goes up, I should say. Um, I'm recording it Saturday, but it'll be going up on Sunday. So tomorrow, on Monday, there will be a, a screening at AMC Lincoln Square 13 at 7.30 p.m. Doors open at 6.30, they said. Seating, and, you know, seating starts at 7.15. And there's a link to RSVP, but I think it's already booked. And I, I'm, I'm too late on this. This went up while I was at work, and I just didn't have time to post about it. So I'm at least quoting it here. I think I threw it up on the community board, but I'm at least you know mentioning it here in this video that there will be something. So we'll probably hear more you know feedback starting tomorrow. And so there could be spoilers, because I don't know if Tom will be there to ask everyone to promise not to say anything so who knows you know so again we're a couple days away at least here in the u.s i know people in other countries you got to wait longer people in australia waiting till thanksgiving till november 25th to see this movie um it just really sucks i wish this movie was coming out much closer together at least all in october that would have been great if it could have but uh but you know hopefully you know you don't get spoiled too much and like i said if i do any spoilers I'll make sure that I, you know, mention it here that, and I'll put warnings everywhere and stuff. Uh, for example, uh, there are some more, you know, because we got the screening, so we're probably going to hear more feedback like this. Uh, there's already a new TV spot going out there that has more feedback in it from fan screenings and stuff. And people saying that this movie's a wild ride and that they're very exciting. It's like one of the most bonkers movie of the year, whatever the quote is, uh, that's up on screen there. Uh, so again, just be careful online over the next couple days or week or wherever you are in the world, the next month or two months, like, God, that's such a long time to wait, but be ready because there will be people talking about stuff probably sooner than we think. Um, so just, you know, be ready for that. And that's why I'm not showing any footage from this new trailer or this new TV spot, because other than those quotes there, they do show clips that weren't in previous, uh, you know, TV spots or trailers. And there's some scenes, including a uh, a party scene that's all I'm going to say about it um, but there's a party scene that we talked about way back like a year a year and a half ago we saw people behind the scenes uh, behind the camera wearing uh, like you know raver glow stick necklaces and stuff and I was like what are those for you know what's what's that alluding to is there going to be a rave in this movie and then we saw people popping up on the uh, IMDB saying that they're ravers or revelers or party goers and stuff and so it, it seems like this, you know, new TV spot kind of spoils some things in that scene. Nothing major that will ruin the plot, I don't think. But still, if you want to still go in as clean as possible to this movie, beware. All these TV spots, everything coming out now, it's going to show stuff that uh, we haven't seen yet. And it could give away too much or maybe it's too much you want to see. So just tread carefully is all I'm saying uh, leading up to the movie. So we got all that, you know, all that great information. We got these four new uh, posters for the movie as well, uh, character posters. One of them kind of has a minor spoiler in it, I think, although I did share it on my community board. It's not a major spoiler, and we don't even know if really if it's happening in the movie, uh, to be fair. But they released character posters, and you get the human versions of each character and their potential alter egos. 
and uh, and obviously you know they have an and poster and there's a silhouette underneath her that could allude to something that we might see again that we've all been talking about and hoping to see again um or it could just be there because it was in the first movie and they're just they wanted to do something for her poster so whatever so but again i just wanted to you know throw up a little warning saying that there was a potential spoiler there in case you didn't want to see it even though i did post it on my community board but i'll be honest when i posted those i didn't even notice the silhouettes underneath them so uh so if i would have seen it or paid more attention because i was at work when i posted those yeah, I would have, um, you know, put a, a, a like a, a minor spoiler warning. So, uh, so yeah, so we got all that stuff. Um, if you're into merchandising stuff, the the Funko Pops are out there. I saw the giant Carnage one at Walmart the other day. Um, but then there's also stuff out there like this black suit Spider Man from the miniature Marvel Le Legends line, uh, which is cool. I definitely wanted to own this. Uh, I want to thank my coworkers. So they made me Employee of the Month and they gave me a Target gift card. And after getting groceries and stuff, I was able to treat myself to a few items, and this was one of them. So I'm very excited. Uh, I'm going to use this in an upcoming video when we get into the black costume Spider-Man arc for sure. So thank you so much for watching the show. Thanks for the support. Thanks for everything over the past four years. The great memories, you know, just the love and everything. Uh, you know, we are Venom and it's been great doing the show and, uh, and you know, conversing with all of you and making friends over the years. It's been awesome. So thank you very much. We're so close. We're nearing the finish line now. I'm so pumped. And I have a lot more comic book stuff coming up for you guys over the next few episodes leading up to the release of this movie. So thank you so much. I'll see you all in the future. Peace.